Hello and welcome to the channel. My name is Drew. This is Just a Guy Linux, and this is going to be another video on a Firefox plugin. Now, if you recall, the last video I did was on a Firefox extension called Tab Stash. And what I thought that was very good at was basically grouping together bookmarks that you want to then reuse and categorize. I like the fact that I can use it for a number of different use cases. However, let me talk about using bookmarks within a Nextcloud instance. And that's what we're looking at today. Now, I'm a big fan of self-hosting Nextcloud. And one of the reasons why is because I can share my bookmarks with the rest of my family as part of this user group. Now, I'm using Flockus in order to do that. It's a very good uh, synchronization tool for Nextcloud bookmarks. I already have the Flockus extension installed. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna start with adding a new profile. And you can see that it has a number of ways to synchronize. Now we're gonna use just the Nextcloud bookmarks today, but you can probably see another use case for you if you choose to. Now I'm just gonna go with Nextcloud bookmarks and hit continue. And I'm going to put in a profile of Nextcloud. Okay, and hit continue. Now with this, I'm gonna be using the internal IP addresses rather than the subdomain that I have created for my Nextcloud instance. So I am going to just remove this and put in the uh, IP address. Oh, wrong one. Okay, and then hit connect and then sign in and then log in and grant and now we are connected okay now let's close this as instructed and we're going to look at this uh, page now as far as the server target I'm going to keep it basically at the first level rather than create another um, folder within the bookmarks, uh, Nextcloud bookmarks. And what I am going to do though is change this. So I don't want all of the bookmarks, okay? I just want bookmarks within the toolbar. And I'll tell you why. Because if I go into other bookmarks, tab stash is gonna be there. And I'm not sure I want to synchronize tab stash in this case, okay? so. I am just going to pick this section, which has a lot of my stuff here uh, in the bookmarks toolbar, and I'm going to hit save, okay, and then hit continue. Now it is giving me interval, intervals, rather 15 minutes, and I am just going to go continue, and there you go. All right, so let's go over here. It says it synchronized one second ago. Okay, let's just go ahead and make sure that that's all good. Now, I'm just going to close this. And as you can see, the synchronization has worked. And so all of my bookmarks from the, what is this called? <laughs> I forget. The uh, toolbar, there we go. Toolbar has been synchronized with my Nextcloud uh, bookmarks. And... Now I, now I can do lots of different things with them. Let's say I just want to share my anniversary ideas. I'm gonna share this folder and I'm gonna go over here. Now there's only one other pers uh, person, it's actually a fake person in this group and it's called Jag Linux. And so I'm able to share uh, that folder of bookmarks with that person. Now I am gonna go ahead and close the sidebar. So the question will be, though, what if somebody like a family member shares with you in return? Is it going to synchronize with your Firefox? And let's take a look at that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to log out of and this is my app. I'm right now in the profile Drew. OK, I'm so I'm going to log out 
and I am going to switch over to my JAG Linux uh, login. So I'm going to log in. And I am going to go to bookmarks. And now you can see that I have shared, I mean, the shared uh, anniversary ideas from Drew is now in my bookmarks for Nextcloud. However, I want to be able to share uh, my shared with Drew folder. It only has two links in it. All right, let's go with that. And let's say Drew. And we're going to share that. All right, and we're going to close the sidebar. Now, I don't know how long it takes. However, I am thinking, so actually, let me just go ahead and log out, okay? And it doesn't even matter that I'm logged into uh, Nextcloud or not, but I am gonna go back to Drew. Actually, that's not even the right password, is it? All right. And close, and I'm gonna go to bookmarks and shared with me Oop, let me just close that all bookmarks oh here it is shared with drew right there okay and it says shared so what happens if i go over here and synchronize will it show up in my firefox because i don't even need to be let's go ahead and just log out or close that window if i'm over here and i'm in my bookmarks and i'm let's just go to manage bookmarks okay and right there, there's my shared with Drew uh, that's coming from a completely different user. All right, I have all of, and so it's been added to my bookmarks toolbar. I hope that made sense, okay? So basically this, share, this shared folder from a different user, a family member presumably, or a coworker for that matter, uh, allows you to, this situation allows you to share everything uh, into Firefox. We're using this as the example, but I don't think Flockus is just a Firefox thing. It can be used on a, any browser for that matter. Okay. But the, you know, the, the clear idea here is to synchronize your next cloud bookmarks and whether they're shared or not, they show up in your browser. Anyway, that was incredibly confusing there at the end. Uh, regardless, uh, I hope that you got something out of this. I really like this uh, functionality with Nextcloud and using the Flockus uh, extension. It makes things a lot easier for me to share with my wife, for example. Okay, so anyway, have a good day and see you soon.